What's going on guys, it's your boy DVJ here today with another Destiny video and in today's video I'm going to run you guys through my King's Full Raid Challenge Mode War Priest looting results and then I'm going to give you guys my opinion on an issue which broke out yesterday amongst the Destiny community but getting straight into my loot and starting with my Hunter uh, obviously we're going to get the Calcified Fragment and the actual emblem on all three characters so it's not even worth mentioning but I also got the 320 artifact which is a guarantee when this challenge mode boss is completed on that hard mode you also get the normal drops too that being a 310 artifact and what other loot drops normally when defeating war priest the artifact on my hunter is the thrall skin drum and the 320 weapon i received was the harold quillam's terminus which is the heavy machine gun with not actually a bad roll to be honest you can also see on screen now a buddy of mine got the fist of eight moons artifact which for sure is a nod in the direction of the galahorn Moving on to my Titan and the 320 artifact I received was the Suit Pearl and the 320 weapon I received was the Harold Frenzy Rocket Launcher. One I already own so this bad boy will be getting infused. Moving on to my Warlock and the artifact I received was the Numinous Web and the weapon I received was the Harold Defiance of Yasmin. So actually this challenge mode loot has paid off for me as I received all war priest weapons at a 320 attack you can't ask for more now last night not long after challenge mode was dropped there was an uproar in the destiny community youtubers and streamers getting bashed on reddit and so on due to the fact a lot of bigger youtubers and streamers and a lot of other people too not really agreeing with how easy and not much of a difference challenge mode is 99% of us do war priests this way anyway. Me personally, I do agree it should have been a lot more of a challenge. The thing is here, there are two different types of Destiny players. There are people like me, big YouTubers, Twitch people and a lot of the community who can and do grind the hell out of this game. We can argue that we have spent many, many hours getting to the stage we are at now, level and weapon wise. We are the hardcore players. Then there are casual players. People who have school and study, people who have full time jobs and families to look after, who can't afford to play 10 hours a day. Me personally, I am on no side here. I understand it from both perspectives. The hardcore feel loot such as a guaranteed 320 artifact and weapon should not be this easy to obtain as they have spent hours beforehand working their way up to such weapons and so on. While the casual players feel as though because they can't grind for days, things like this are great. I'm sure though most will agree on the point that the War Priest Challenge is far too well normal and that cannot be denied. But as for the hardcore casual player differences, one could argue that Destiny may not be a game for casual players. At one time I would have certainly agreed. But over the past six months, we have seen Destiny turn into a game which, in my opinion, is more suited for the casual player. But that's just my opinion. How do you stand on this matter? Do you agree with how easy challenge mode seems to be? Or do you think it should be a lot more of a challenge? Also, are you a casual player or a hardcore player? Me personally, I was a hardcore player, but the lack of new content and how easy it is to earn that loot has turned me into a casual player, which ain't a bad thing, as I can spend more time playing other games. I think a lot of people in this community take this game way too seriously, and at the end of the day, and this is coming from a person whose life has changed for the better, and a life basically paid for by Destiny, even I'd tell you guys that this is just a game. People need to go outside more. And on that note, I'm going to end the video. But guys, I hope you enjoyed it. Give me your opinion on this matter. Thanks for stopping by as always. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out until next time. Peace. We all on YouTube every damn day, watching these vids of the brand new games. Bid after bid, many of y'all the same, that's why you gotta go and find DPJ. Destiny gameplays, weekly snipes, heavy uploads gonna have you a hype. Started in the UK, now he's worldwide. DPJ, go and subscribe.